Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Dr. Kitty Fox, and today we are doing the Q&A video today, and I'll be answering all your questions, so let's get right, let's get right into it. So I was going to do a live commentary of me doing the, all the questions in the Q&A, all the Q&A video, but my camera died, so I need, I need to get batteries for it, so I can't do any live video at the moment. But anyway, I, I can do it, I can do it from my desktop from, from right here. So the rest, let's get, let's get started for our first comment. So our first question that he's asked me is my friend Jason, who's a furry. So let's see what he says. So he says, who is your favorite furry YouTuber and what is your favorite song? So my favorite furry YouTuber is actually myself. Because I'm a kitty fox. I like, I like my own channel. The other furry YouTubers, eh, eh, they're fine I guess. But I like myself because I'm an awesome little, key, key, little kitty fox. But anyway, the answer, the answer to that is, to my, is myself. My channel. And another question is, what is your favorite song? Uh, I like Halo songs, but I'm more, I'm more in the opera. I love I love seventies to sixties opera. It's th th those, 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 those are kind of those are kind of my favorite songs right there. Old songs. I like old songs. So next question from Doctor A: Do you play Forza? Yes, I play Forza. Let me answer that question quickly. Also, will you bring back the, the gaming videos? Yes, I I have I have brought a few of them back. I'm just not going to be uploading like gaming videos on my channel because I really I really want my channel to be a furry channel to be uploading a lot of like logging and kind of RC stuff in the way. I like to do I like to do a lot of my fur suit in a way. But yes, I'll bring back a lot of my gaming videos pretty soon. Just not for a while. But I'll play a few and few there and there with my friends, but not for a while. But yes, uh but yes, I'll be bringing them back pretty soon. So don't worry. Just not as often. All right, on to the next question, and this is a guy I know for you. I know on YouTube for a very long time. He's just hit 1K, so congrats, man. So he's asking, "This isn't. Oh wait, this is this. Uh, yeah, I answered the question a while ago. But anyway, um, all, all I was really asking is, how do I how do I record the footage in my headgear while I'm talking and talking for the headgear, make clearly? So I use earbuds to to, to do my commentary in the headgear when I'm talking. So if I have the volume on too low, it won't it, it may sound muffled. But if I have it really loud, the volume, the mic volume, it becomes clear. So that's how I, that's, that's that's how I talk to the headgear. Is I, I use earbuds while I'm talking. There's a little wire that leads outside the behind my back that leads to the computer. But yeah, that's how I talk to in my headgear and do all the dollar commentaries inside the headgear. Basically, I use the earbud mic earbuds. And for his uh, Q and A question he says but this is for the Q&A if a fox or a wolf are fighting what does it the elephant get to do well I don't know how to answer that I guess stomp on both of them I'm take it stomp on them show moves boss <laughs> so next question is an RC question from a really good friend named RC Basher bro and he asks, will you be doing that showing channel on the green screen while crawling a video again? I would like to come on, uh, come out there. Also, can you, uh, can you do a shout out on my channel? Would highly appreciate it. Uh, uh, yes, I'll be doing a lot more RC on the green screen eventually coming soon. I, I did one, I did one for you, and you, you come in a while, uh, 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 yesterday, it was pretty, you liked it. You like that one a lot, so 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 definitely, yeah, definitely, I did a lot more of it. I mean, a lot of my RC fans kind of like it. Have an RC on the green screen, since I have a green screen, it's still pretty cool. And your other question is a shout out. I don't do shout outs on my channel. I don't do it. I don't really do a shout out on my channel. I stopped doing it like years ago. So sadly, sadly, I don't, I don't do shout outs on my channel. But I can, I can support your channel, but I can't, I can't do shout outs. Sorry, that's the thing I don't do anymore. I don't do anymore. So that next question from my very good friend on YouTube, who's been really active with me lately. I like her very much. She asks, "Where did you get your outfit, your furry, or how to say it is? Where did you get your furry outfit from?" So I got it from my my for my fur suit from different makers in general. I got the I got on I got on a furry website maker basically a, a, a website maker that makes fur suits for a living. Percy Maker. You can like, type in Google and type in Google Percy Maker. But I got got I got it got from this website called um I think I can't pronounce it. It's like T it's like E T's or T D's or something like that. Has it? It's spelled um, it's spelled E T S Y. 
you go in there, you go in the fur fur headgear, and it pops up instantly, pops up instantly. You can find a lot of furry gears on there from paws, uh, feet paws, and headgear, body gear. You can find wherever you need for building, building, building a uh, headgear or whatever fur suit in the way. But yeah, that's that's where I got my headgear from was from there in my outfit in general. I got it from there, so I got it from I got it from different makers basically, different makers. All right, next question from a good friend, Michael Williams. Welcome back, my my furry friend. Hope all is good. Nice to nice to see you back. I would like to ask, how did you do that animation intro? I am interested in doing something like that. Did you pay someone to set that up, or did you make do it your do it yourself? Is there a type of program I need to set up on my computer? Always great video. Thank you, brother, and have a good day. Uh, yeah, thank you, man. I'm glad to be back as well. I'm very glad to be back. So the program I use to make my intros is I use After Effects, uh, Photoshop, and Paint S to do all my to do all my intro stuff. I use um, After Effects to do any to do any animation that's involved, like moving my characters around and moving some layouts around on there. I use After Effects to do all my intros and out intros as well. So yeah, you can download the After Effects on Adobe website. You can probably download it. It costs money to get it. It's, by the way, it costs money to get it, but it's pretty amazing software. You can do a lot on there. Make 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 a lot of 2D intros on there. So it's pretty cool. I, I do I do I do recommend you get it. It's pretty good pretty good intro software. All right, next question to my to, to my to my furry friend the fox. He says, "Welcome back." And his question is, "Do you have a special experience or moment or memory in the furry fandom? If yes, which one?" Well, to me, that's my opinion. I don't count myself as a, as a, as part of the part of the furry fandom. I'm, I'm probably another part of a furry. I'm part of the Christian furry stuff, so I'm not really in that furry fandom as much. I'm part of the Christian furry fandom. So I don't, I for memories wise, I like the first time I made my own uh, persona at a drawing. So that's a good memory, I think of it. First day I made it, first day I made it on paper. It was perfect. I loved it. I'm always loved it ever since. So I think if I so I said to answer your question, memories wise. Making my first persona, basically. Making my first persona, in general. It was so much fun, and he's so cute. I love Dark the Kitty Fox. He's, so, he's such a cute little kitty fox. Alright, next question from Let's Be Frank. He says, great video. Question, what screen capture are you using? Well, I use a, a capture card called, uh, it's called Screen Record Air. It, it's just designed to record your screen for, for doing like projects like a speed paint video or some like recording you're doing, but it doesn't really do much really. It's just, it's like, it's not really that good to say that, but I, but I, I, use, I use that to do a lot of screen, screen recordings. But I mostly use my video camera to, or my camera to do, a lot, to, do a lot, to do a lot of my commentary and do a lot of my record on me and my first suit, but really that's really what I use recently, Tatro, that's what I use the most. All right. Next question. My a good friend of mine. He asked, "I have one question for, to you." He asked, "What RPG game do you like?" He, so my RPG game I like the most is Metroid. I love Metroid. I've been, I played it since I was a kid. I still love it ever since I was a kid. It's kind of it's kind of a mix of a horror, a horror game, mix of a kids game. That kids, it's for kids to play. It's still a pretty awesome game. It's still really hard, but I still love it. So yeah, Metroid is a game I like for an RPG game. Still love it and I always will for many years. It's called Metroid. Alright, next question. She says, Will you accept my hug? I'm sure, why not? I'll give you a hug. Hugs. How about that? So, I don't mind hugs, I don't mind. But yeah, I think that is it with the QA video questions, because I don't see any more questions on this video. But yeah, guys, that was actually quite fun. Now, I don't pl I'm not I'm not gonna do that QA video for a very long time. Maybe when I hit 2k subs, free say kids subs, one, one of those two, but not for a while, but yeah, but yeah, it was fun, I had, I had a fun time doing the Q&A video, it was fun, a lot of, a lot of, there weren't a lot of questions on the Q&A video, but whatever, nothing to do about it, but yeah, it was a great video, anyway guys, but yeah, it was a great video, so the rest guys, hope, hope you guys had the video, and all the rest, see you later guys, have a good day, ciao.